Hi, my name is Justin Odisho, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this word by word animation in Adobe Premiere Pro. So, I suppose you could do this on a black background or whatever you want. I've just got a clip in the background for some style. And to start from scratch, you're simply going to grab your type tool, make sure you have your program window highlighted, and then click and it'll create a new text graphic layer. So, here's where you can type out your first word. So, let's type out I, that's my first word or letter. And in the essential graphics panel, here's where we can do a few things. For me, I want to just center it vertically and horizontally and maybe increase the scale a lot more. We're going to do like a big title screen. Um, just make sure I center it again. And here's where you can also choose the font, the text size, and different aspects about the character and color if you want. I'm just going to leave everything white, but you do have those options. Now, one thing I do want to do is make sure it's also center aligned as well rather than left. So that means that way when I switch words, they'll all be coming from a center point. And again, I just center it if it ever goes out of place from any adjustment. Now I'm going to make sure this graphic is as long as I want it over the clip or not and go to the starting point where I want the animation to begin wherever I want. And in the effects control panel, I'm going to drop down that text graphic and I'm going to add a keyframe to toggle animation on the source text. So I'll add this keyframe there and it'll create a keyframe for what we currently are at, which is the letter I. Now I'm going to move over, let's say some sort of even amount. If I want to make it easy for me to count, I can just do like hold shift and move my arrow key over one, two. That'll move us over 10 frames. Each time you hold shift and move the arrow is five frames or each time you just press the arrow once is one frame. So just an arbitrary spacing of 10 frames in between. And now I'm going to highlight the text and change it to something else. So I'll change it to another word. And you'll see since we do have it from center style, center aligned and everything centered, we don't even have to adjust the position again. It's all still centered. And you'll see it creates a new keyframe with this new source text. Now I'm going to move over again. I'll do 10 frames for my example and I'll choose another word. And I can keep doing this pretty easily until I write out as much words or sentences that I want. Remember, if you ever want to jump to a certain keyframe, you can press this button to go to previous or forward keyframes if you want to readjust things. And another cool part about this is since it's all on one frame, if you wanted to, as a touch, add some gradual movement and animation, I can go down to the video effects section. I can add a scale keyframe, for example, go all the way to the end of the clip or that last keyframe and I can make it gradually go up like 25 points. So it's animating and getting larger at the same time. Just an idea if you wanted to mix two different animations. But that's one quick way when working with text graphics in Premiere to animate multiple different words to create animated sentences. If you enjoyed this video, definitely check out some of my other effect tutorials, text effects, graphics. Premiere or After Effects, and subscribe to my channel here on YouTube to stay tuned for all of my new videos. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.